Auzubillahimineşşeytanirracim. Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Good evening boys. Good evening everyone. Hi, this is Muhammad Imran Hussain, your science teacher. Today I am going to teach you unit number one, humans and animals. Lesson number 1.5, drugs as medicine. Drugs as medicine. Page number 14 and 15. Today we will discuss about drugs as medicine. Okay, so kindly open your learner's book, page number 14 and 15. And look at today's date, 21st of September, 2020. Day, Monday. Okay, look at here. Learning objective of this lesson. Explain the rules of drug as medicine. Okay, understand that medicines prevent cure. Identify ways in which medicines are taken. Plan an investigation and decide how to collect evidence. Okay, so open your science learner's book, page number 14. So you can see on the screen, there is a cigarette packet. So what? So first I will tell you about the drugs. Okay, cigarette tobacco also be a drug. Okay. Drugs are substance that make your body change in some ways. Many drugs have good efforts, but some drugs can harm your body. So which kind of drugs you can take? Look at here, there is two kind of drugs. One each, one drug make you healthy and one drugs make your body to harm. Okay, like you can see on the screen, there is a cigarette packet. Tobacco is the drug in cigarette. Tobacco also be a drug, but in cigarette. Tobacco can harm the lungs. If you smoke, you are lens will harmful okay so medicines now we discuss about the medicines medicine when people are unwell you know if you feel headache or if you feel sickness or if you feel weakness on that time you used to take medicines right we take medicine and to help make us feel better when we have and illness some medicines are prevent us from getting ill not all drugs are medicine and one more thing you have to understand here all drugs are not medicines tobacco for example is not a medicine already i told you tobacco is not a medicine now I will tell you how to take a medicine. Okay, we take different kinds of medicine in different way, right, boys? And you can see on the screen there is a medicine. Okay, some medicines come as a powder. Some medicines come as a powder that we have to mix with water. Okay, boys. And see this picture. We breathe in medicine, okay, from inhalers, holders for asthma and other breathing problem. You can take this medicine or which sometimes you can see some people have a breathing problem, asthma problem. So they use this kind of medicine. And you can see in this picture, okay, we drink cough medicines to help us to stop coughing. And look at here, people who are very ill in hospital, okay, if you are very ill, if you are very sick, then what you have to admit in the hospital. After I get the medicines directly into the blood, throw up a drip, throw up a drip. Okay, boys, and see, how to do how do people take medicine? You know that they take different kind of medicine in different way. Okay, 
plan and carry out and investigate to find out the difference way that people you know take medicines how will you collect the information you need it how will you present your finding okay boys and look at here now i will play a video for you look this video watch this video okay You may have already watched our video about pharmacology and drugs. But if not, let's recap. What is a drug? A drug is a substance that when released into the body will cause an effect. Some are legal, some are illegal, and some are prescribed by doctors to treat illnesses. Whether a drug is legal or not, or can be bought without a prescription, varies by country. Recreational drugs are substances that people choose to take, like for example nicotine in tobacco, alcohol or cocoa leaves in the Andes. In this video you're going to learn about two different types of drugs and their effects on the body. The two types of drugs are stimulants and depressants. Why don't you pause the video here and try to guess the difference between the two. Stimulants give increased alertness and the speed of reactions, heart rate and blood pressure. You can think of them as substances that speed you up. Stimulants also reduce a person's appetite. Caffeine, found in coffee, tea and energy drinks, is a legal stimulant. Cocaine is usually an illegal stimulant and is highly addictive. As with most illegal drugs, Taking too much can kill you because of an overdose. Cocaine dramatically increases your risk of a heart attack. Also, after taking cocaine, even just once, people will suffer what's called a come down. The user may feel depressed, have anxiety or panic attacks, hallucinations, or be unable to sleep. Cocaine is often snorted through the nose. If used long term, it can damage the nose to such an extent that the user can lose the septum of their nose. The second type of drug is depressants. They slow down reaction times, decrease inhibitions, damage brain cells, relax users, and make them more sociable. You can think of them as substances that slow you down. Alcohol is a depressant. Another common example is cannabis. It's usually smoked, but can also be baked in cakes and made into tea. Cannabis relaxes people, but it can make it very difficult to learn or concentrate. It can also cause users to become very paranoid, anxious, and sometimes psychotic. Smoking cannabis has been linked to mental health problems such as schizophrenia, especially if it's taken during the teenage years. Which organ system do you think these drugs affect? Most recreational drugs affect the nerve.